All right, what's up everybody? It is Monday morning here. We're gonna get started this morning. We are on week three, day one of day in the life of a 22 year old real estate agent. Um, so I just got in here, it's about 7.35 ish. Um, I'm gonna review the hot sheet, go through my inbox, see if I missed anything over the weekend. Kind of recap the weekend. Um, Saturday I went out of town, went up to a Michigan football game. So that was a great time Sunday. I had a showing, wrote an offer, and then a listing appointment, so it was a pretty busy Sunday. Um, sadly, our offer did not get accepted. This uh, particular client is going to be first right to refusal. Um, we're trying to work around a couple things to see if maybe we can drop that contingency. So I'm going to be working on that today, talk with a couple people. Also, follow up with the agent who we lost out on and see how we lost. Was Were we too low on dollar amount? Um, or was it the other terms and the contingency and whatnot? That way it gives you a good idea of what to expect when you're in this market. So I'm gonna be following up with him today. I'm also following up with another agent who's shown my uh, lake listing quite a few times. And I'm gonna let her know, you know, hey, we're gonna be winterizing the cottage coming up very soon. So, you know, if you wanna do something, um, now is probably the time. So we're gonna be winterizing that next Saturday, get that done with for the season. Um, and then listing B, is expired today so i'm gonna go grab all my signs again you know it's no fault of us really i mean we had a 30-day listing contract we went under contract twice with the house in its current condition just wasn't working out so then listing b that went live uh two thursdays ago appraisal is this week i followed up with the agent on an inspection because it hasn't been scheduled yet so we're gonna see where they're at on that um, and then other than that i'm gonna see you guys in the next clip all right, so we just finished up our dial session. It is about 10 o'clock this morning. Um, everything went good. Had a couple conversations, mostly voicemails today. We had a lot a lot of to-dos, had over 50. Um, still got 10 more to do, but those are people that I've already called this morning. I need to wait a little bit um, and then give them another call again today, try to get them on the phone. Um, called all the for sale by owners. That all went good. Checked in with the agent on getting inspection scheduled. That's all good to go. Scheduled for tomorrow. Appraisal's Wednesday, so we are moving right along on that one, thankfully. Now we're going to head out to my listing that expired. Go grab my signs, my lockbox, all that fun stuff because it's officially expired now, which sucks. But, hey, things work out, so I'll see you guys after I pick all that stuff up. All right, so we just got back from picking up everything. Got my sign, my lock boxes, flyer stand, brochure stand, all that fun stuff, so that's all done. I got the key, I'm waiting on the seller to call me so I can give her the key back because I just didn't want to leave it there. So, waiting on that. I did follow up with an agent who showed my lake listing quite a few times. Um, she said her people are super interested, but the husband kind of has some worries, so, we're just waiting that one out, see where we can get at it, and uh, hopefully go on a contract soon. Uh, I know my clients are kind of ready to get this thing gone, so um, hopefully we'll have good news out of that, and I will talk to you guys later. All right, so we just heard back from the agent about our offer last night. Said they were very similar. The biggest tweak was they had a really quick close. Um, we could not offer that because of our contingency. So it's great to find out, you know, where we are if we were competitively priced, if we weren't. So this tells me, you know, we're really competitive price-wise, but the other terms need a little bit of work. And with this contingency, I mean, we, we wouldn't be able to do a quick close like that so no big deal you know I'll talk to my buyer about that see what we can get figured out going forward get a better game plan wrapped up you know this one was kind of on a whim um, she had originally stopped looking saw this one loved it so it was a lot of you know quick pace planning at one time so I think here going forward we're gonna have a better plan uh, we did the listing appointment we have all that squared away so now we can just go 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 as soon as that time's right and get things in motion Got my content posted for today, um, so that's great. I'm gonna share my team lead, Jake's Monday Market Update that he does weekly. Um, just goes over the numbers for our county, Allen County here in Indiana, so he touches on all those and then brings in a nice little current event uh, topic, which is pretty cool. So with that, I'm gonna get back to it. I got a couple of dials to make still from people who you know asked to be called later in the day or just didn't get to them this morning, so I will see you guys later. All right, so we just finished up ordering our CRM, so I went through, made sure everybody's strips were going, all that was squared away, that way nobody slips through the cracks, because nothing's worse than calling somebody six months from now, realizing they already bought a home, 
terrible feeling to have. So I like to do that at least once a week. Sometimes it gets done, sometimes it doesn't. So this was a really good deep dive into all of them, make sure everything was going. So now that that's done, um, I gotta leave two more people voicemails for the day and then um, my call should be pretty much done for the day. And that's gonna end out the day today, really. I mean, it's a really good day of just, you know, getting through things that had to get done, auditing the CRM, getting content posted, getting deals squared away for the week, all that fun stuff. Um, and sometimes that's the days like today where you know you're not out showing property, but you're doing all the things that move your business forward. So that is great to do. So with that, I'm gonna leave you guys. Thank you for watching.